My name is Neil Dixon, I'm the Subject Librarian for Business. This video is all about Business Source Premier. So this is Business Source Premier. So I recommend using the advanced search just there. So if you're doing a topic like, for example, effective leadership styles on productivity, you could put in a keyword like leadership. So you'll see you've got 166,000 results here. Um, so what you can do is advantage of the advanced search is that you can enter additional words and narrow down how many you get. So we mentioned leadership styles and influence on productivity. So think about what kind of styles you might be looking for. So for example, democratic. So we narrowed it down to 3000 results now with that extra word. So this and here, that means you're searching for leadership and democratic because uh, unlike a search engine like Google, this business source premier only relies on the keywords that you're putting in. Whereas Google uses the popularity of the results uh, and like your location and it brings other factors into your search. So it works slightly differently to that. So we've still got 3000, so we need to narrow it down even more. So you can add extra words in, so you can add as many boxes as you want. So you could put in productivity as well. So now we've narrowed it down to 23. But say we wanted to uh, expand our results a little bit, you can use the other operator, which is called or, and that means you're searching for either word. So you can put in or performance. So we've got 152 results, which is a nice number to go through. You've also got your filters down your left hand side here, so you can narrow it down by publication date. You can go peer review journals, you can see the different publication types, academic journals. So you've got 37 results there. So what you can do is if you think any of these results are relevant, you just click on the little folder icon there. And then at the top, see your folder, click on that. So you've got two results. And then what you can do is read the abstract, we're going to page options and then go into detailed. And the abstract is just a summary of the journal article there. And to get a hold of the full text, click on check for full text at Angular Ruskin. We don't have everything, so sometimes you might not be able to get hold of it. Quite a lot of them are available as PDFs, like this one here. So just click on the full text PDF, and that opens up, and then you can save it and do what you want with it.